This Olympic and Paralympic Museum here certainly filled with the rich history of Team USA and our athletes and that's where News 5's Caroline Peters is live with us this morning. She's around the corner for me having all the fun. Caroline uh, taking part in all the interactive <laughs> yes, displays they have here. Not to rub it in Ira, but too much fun here. As you can see, this is Alpine skiing. This museum is so interactive and it allows you to really dig into those stories and experiences that these athletes have. And you can also talk to the athletes as they offer you feedback as you participate in these events. There are over 12,000 US Olympians and Paralympians each with their own unique story. This museum breaks down the stories of those athletes by showcasing the Hall of Fame, the intro to the game, the Parade of Nations, and of course, the Summer and Winter Games, along with so much more. Our News 5 team had the chance to speak with Paralympic silver medalist John Register, who says the stories within this museum inspire people across the globe. Olympic spans the globe, not just in our hamlet here in Colorado, uh, not just in, 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 in the United States, but across the world. So when I say we are Olympic City USA, come and visit, people take up that offer because they want to see who's the greatest uh, country that has come and, and won the medal count over and over again. Now, for those of you who wish to explore the museum, you can purchase tickets online. The museum offers discounts for military, first responders, and seniors. And now's a good time to come and engage with the interactiveness of the museum. Also, to watch the museums, the, to watch the Olympics on NBC right here in the museum as well. That will be on the big screen. Of course, I'll post all this information to our website, koaa.com. In Colorado Springs, Caroline Peters, News 5.